morning, everybody. We are up super early for today's trip. My alarm went off at 3 a.m. this morning, but what is nice about waking up this early is at this time of day, there's hardly ever anyone on the road. Anyway, today is the start of a three-day flight attendant trip. I had two flights today, the first being from Philly to Miami, and then the second from Miami to Barbados. After we landed, we loaded up in the van and it was time to head to our hotel. And wow, let me tell you, the view is gorgeous and absolutely worth the early wake up this morning. Hi everybody, I just got to my hotel and oh my gosh, I seriously cannot believe that we are here right now. It is gorgeous, stunning, beautiful blue water, perfect sunny day, like I am just almost in shock at how beautiful it is here and just how grateful I am for this layover. You all know me, I am such a beach girl. This is my perfect vibe. This is exactly what I love. Let me quickly show you guys around the hotel room. So right here, when you walk in, we just have this closet. And then here is the bathroom. We have this large mirror right here, the sink and everything. Here is the shower and then there also is a bathtub over here too. There's a coffee maker right here and then some artwork above. Across from the coffee maker, we do have a full length mirror. And then to the left, we have a king size bed. There is some artwork above the bed. And then across from the bed, we have a TV with a desk. And if you keep moving this way, there's the chair right there. And then of course, this beautiful view with a balcony. I am I'm about to pack my bag so I thought I would show you guys everything that I think is essential for a beach trip like what you should put in your beach bag as well as different items that I like to bring with me personally on beach layovers and vacations so in my beach bag I personally think less is more I try to bring the least amount of stuff possible with me just so my bag doesn't feel so heavy and I don't feel like I'm lugging all of this stuff with me but I do have a few essential items that I always take to the beach number one obviously a big bag Bag that you can put all of your stuff in. I also always bring a water bottle where I can keep my drink cool. So like right now, this is my hydro flask filled with ice water so I can stay nice and hydrated when I'm out in the sun. Some form of sunscreen or tanning oil, just something. Make sure you always have something with you. I also always bring my Kindle or a book with me as well as my AirPods because sometimes I want to listen to an audiobook or watch YouTube videos or whatever when I'm just laying out in the sun. And for me, I also always bring my GoPro so that way I can vlog while I am in the water. Of course, I'm going to bring a pair of sunglasses. And then I have this sunglass case right here and I'm going to keep my credit card and my room key in here. But obviously I'm not gonna show those things to you guys on camera, but I'm going to keep those in this case instead of bringing my entire wallet with me down to the beach in this bag. And then of course too, you have to have sandals. I am assuming that they have towels out by the beach or by the pool so I'm not gonna bring a towel from the room with me and then a few toiletry items that I always bring with me pretty much on every trip but especially beach trips are travel size shampoo and conditioner some sort of face sunscreen I really like the different SPF with 30 also I always travel with this it's a 10 miracle leave-in product it's a spray conditioner this is great for detangling your hair after you have been in the ocean I love 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 this stuff and then I I also never leave for any trip, but especially a beach trip without my Harry's razor. Especially with the spring and summer months right around the corner, I know that I will be shaving more frequently and the only razors that I have genuinely used over the last few years are Harry's. Also, if you didn't know, Harry's makes more awesome products other than razors and now is the perfect time to try them out with their Shave and Suds bundle. The bundle includes one orange Truman handle plus two blades, an eight count pack of blades, one free travel size body wash, and one free travel size exfoliating face wash. I personally have loved using Harry's products over the last few years because their blades provide such a close shave without irritating my skin. And just in general, their products make my skin feel so good, silky, and smooth. All of the products I mentioned above in Harry's Shave and Suds bundle are currently 18% off at $27. This bundle is available exclusively 
online using my link harrys.com slash jenningjulia. It's also important to note that these products are sold individually at many retailers such as Target, Costco, Walmart, and your general drug and grocery stores. Thank you so much to Harry's for sponsoring this video. Make sure you check out the Shave and Suds bundle through my link in the video description box below as well as my pinned comment and you can go to harrys.com slash jettingjulia. And now let's get back to Barbados and back into today's video. All right, you guys. So the plan is to meet up with some of my crew members and we don't really have any plans except to just enjoy this beautiful beach day. Just looking at this view, it's definitely worth the 3 a.m. wake up from this morning. I am out here by the water now. It is beautiful. Remy, say hi to the vlog. <laughs> This is my crew member Michelle. Hi. It is a beautiful day it out is. here. It's so beautiful. Oh yeah, my I gosh. It. Me too. It's so gorgeous. To get this layover, I know. Honestly. Seriously. The sun is on me. The water looks beautiful. I'm so excited. Woo, it's a little bit chilly. Also, I'm a huge baby when it comes to water temperature. Oh, but the like heat from the sun is so hot that the water, it does feel good. I will say it does feel good. Here you guys can see the sun glistening off of the water. Isn't that just beautiful? Sorry, I know I've said the word beautiful like a hundred times in this vlog already, but you know what? It's just, it is what it is. Like it is beautiful out here. And I just feel so grateful that, whoop, here comes the wave. <laughs> I just feel so grateful that this is what I get to do for a living. I get to travel and see these beautiful places and yeah I'm just feeling very fortunate and very lucky it's not always easy like you guys know I mean I got up today at three in the morning with two flights that's not a bad day but the waking up part was not the best <laughs> but not every day looks like this so when I get these little tastes of paradise and perfection oh, it just makes it that much sweeter I don't know how far out I'm allowed to go and I don't want to go out too far but this seems to be where people are stopping. But I think I'm going to, Woo! I think I'm gonna dip my head in the water. That felt nice and refreshing. It is definitely hard to beat this. The only thing that could make this better, obviously, is if Eric was with me. I do miss him a lot when I'm on my work trips. And for some reason, especially today, I miss him a lot, a lot. Like, of course I miss him on every trip I go on, but specifically this trip, I just, I don't know. I really, really miss him and I wish he was here. But what is exciting is a little over a week from today, we will be leaving for St. Lucia for a vacation and to celebrate my best friend Tiffany's wedding, Eric and I will have days to spend on the beach together, which will be so much fun. And the only thing that can make that better is if Luna could go, but obviously Luna can't go to St. Lucia with us, unfortunately. I am not even kidding. I honestly could spend hours out here just doing nothing, just standing in the water with my toes in the sand, watching the waves roll in and hearing the hiss of the ocean, like that sound that it makes after the wave crashes and you can see all the bubbles in the water. I love that sound. I just love being out here. I genuinely could just do this all day long and do nothing else. Just stand here and just stare at the water and just let the waves crash over me. I am obviously back up in my room now. I just took a shower, which felt amazing. There is just something about that post beach shower that just hits different. I don't know why, but it just feels even better than a normal shower. But anyway, today was fabulous. Like I mentioned, I came back up to my room, took a shower and I just threw on some clothes and I'm actually about to meet up with my crew downstairs for dinner. I am so tired though. So right now what I'm doing is I'm trying to pick up my room as much as possible and have everything ready to go 
show that way as soon as I get back from dinner I can just go straight to bed because I have been up for a long time today and I am starting to get like delusional tired but I know that I need to eat dinner so as soon as that's over I'm going to bed I don't know why but I love the way that pools look at night how they're so bright and they just shine I think they look so pretty the camera does not do it justice especially because this camera doesn't work very well at night but oh my gosh that is just so cool looking okay back to my walk and going to dinner Hey guys, so clearly as you can tell, I am home from beautiful Barbados. This was actually part of a three-day flight attendant trip, but some crazy things happened on my next part of my trip and my layover in Miami. So I decided to break up this trip into two separate vlogs. So the Miami vlog will be a different one from this one that you're currently watching. At the time that I am filming this too, Eric and I actually just got home from our vacation in St. Lucia last night, so I have all of that footage that I need to go through and edit as well. So you guys have that vlog coming your way hopefully soon. So yeah, a lot of really fun stuff going on, but I just wanted to say thank you for being here and for watching today's video. Thank you again so much to Harry's for sponsoring this video. Make sure you check out the Shave and Suds bundle through the link in my description or go to harrys.com slash jettingjulia. I hope that you all are having a fabulous day. If you like this video, please give me a big thumbs up. And if you're new here, don't forget to subscribe because I'd love to see you again in future content. Thank you again so much from the bottom of my heart for watching this video, just for being here, supporting me and my channel. It truly does mean the world to me and I'll see you next time. Bye.